I love this festival. The, the great thing about the National Country Festival is that it's in winter. It's a winter festival, it's a long weekend, it's in a regional area, so you've got people coming to an area, uh, and yet there's this real sense of it being intimate as well. My name's Una McAlinden, I'm the director of the National Celtic Festival. We're in the middle of the festival as I speak. Uh, it's in its eighth year and it's, it's flourishing and growing. As a festival, it's about people. It's about bringing, bringing people together. It's about mentoring people in Celtic traditions. It's about supporting young people and keeping their traditions alive. Every year there's more and more young bands playing. And um, like I know, amongst my circle of friends, which is a lot of musicians who are around the Melbourne trad scene. You know, we've all been saying for two months, we've just been like, wow, the Celtic Festival's gonna be amazing because you know, everyone we know is performing at it, you know, it's just gonna be one big party. I'm Jane Collins, I'm one of the members of the committee, the National Celtic Festival here in Port Arlington. I spend most of my weekend in the ticketing office and I'm sort of working with people as they come through the door and I often sort of say to them, um, you know, have you been before or is this your first time? And it's amazing how many people are coming for the first time and they really find out by word of mouth. They've talked to friends or family who've been and they just say, you've got to come to the festival. And it's just kind of this three day explosion of we have to talk about every single thing, we've every subject and play every single tune that we have in common and maybe learn a few new ones. I met up with somebody from my hometown and I met up with several people from Melbourne and from Sydney um, and just, yeah, had a great time. The Culture Ireland kindly sponsored Bioga, the Irish band, the young traditional Irish band, to come to this festival and the embassy was really, really happy to endorse that sponsorship. Um, Bioga were just, they were the lead act for the festival and they were just fantastic. Everybody was jumping in their seats and I remember saying to Una, this is going to be some festival. <laughs> So it's quite a privilege, I think, to be part of a, an event that um, you sort of step back from it. You can sort of see that this notion of connection, um, people sharing stories, really pleased to see each other and really enjoying the music. And, uh, I, think, I think the festival have really got it right. They've got really great acts, but there's a real sense of community amongst the punters and the performers and the locals. Um, and many of the, the, the locals talk about how proud they are to be part of something that sort of you know, brings all these people together to Port Arlington. 